What about the uh, operating costs? That's another important point. Um, so uh, I mentioned just a second ago, it's very efficient. So the air, the, in the air conditioning mode, this is 18 sear. Okay. And a conventional code compliant is 13 sear. Well, that, that doesn't mean a whole lot to most people, most right? Most people, yeah, I don't get that at all. So it, it'll reduce the cost of air conditioning by about 40%. Oh, wow. So that's okay. pretty significant, right? Yeah. Um, and in the heating mode, that that's a little bit different because it depends on your, your fuel source. Mm -hmm. So in this home, oil's expensive. Right. LP propane, also expensive. So running electricity to heat your home against oil, LP, or frankly, electric, mm -hmm. is gonna be less expensive. Now we both know natural gas is very inexpensive. Right. But the efficiency of this makes it at least competitive in the heating mode against uh, natural gas. So. If you run all electric versus mm -hmm. natural gas and air conditioning over the course of the year, this system will be more efficient and less expensive to run than just the code compliant what you'd normally get from a heating and cooling contractor. Right.